Hi guys, it's Timmy with Yellow Sparks Joy. Welcome to my channel. I'm in Calgary today, so of course I'm at the mall. I came to pick up an item from Kate Spade, hopefully, I'm not sure yet. I might get it, I might not get it. But I also came to check out the sale items and the new items at Coach. It's been a while since I've done a shop with me, so I'm very, very excited. I feel like I never come here anymore. It's just so much so much stress to make the two and a half hour drive up here but i'm here today so i'm very very happy and we're gonna go in now so of course i'm gonna bring you guys with me so sit tight let's visit kate spade and Co at the tree so pretty All right, we're in Kate Spade, and this first bag is definitely giving me Gucci vibes. Love that color combination, the tan and the like natural colors. It's just really nice. Also love the layout. A good flat bag is very, always very welcome. One thing I don't like about this bag, however, is the shoulder strap, but that's just personal preference. I think it's a little bit too long. I don't know. It's not that bad, but it's just not my own preferred length but i still think the bag is definitely very beautiful and here are the bags that are part of the um, party collection very beautiful much better in person than i could have imagined looking on the website i did a video on all the party bags all the holiday bags from kate spade and i will link that below so you guys can go and watch the roundup also love the fact that the fabric they've used on that um, Sam Icon version with the stones is like a satin feel fabric. Really like that. Um, I prefer the blue of this top handle to the pink. I've said that even when I saw it online, so it's no surprise that I prefer it in person as well. Here are their full fur bags for the season. I actually love all of them especially this one in green because you guys know that green is my favorite color in a handbag also love these this creamy one i think it's just so practical it will definitely fit well over coats over jackets puffy big all sorts of jackets great for the weather great for the season this is my favorite and this is one of the ones I came to look at in the store because I'm contemplating buying this one. So it's between this and another bag. And I'll show you that one in a minute. But I really, really love this bag. I love the chain and leather strap detail. You know, I love a good chain strap, especially when it has a leather brick. So absolutely love that. And the green color is just gorgeous on that bag. Honestly, I could go on and on on that particular uh, shoulder bag but yeah and that one is called the Clio full fur bucket bag um here's another top handle i like the simplicity of this one i'm not so sure the materials it's made with but it looks very nice good layout on the inside um i love the buckle the front plaque buckle i think Kate spade has done a revamp on their branding the buckles and the name plates and the clasp are different and I definitely prefer this version. It's a much elevated Kate Spade that we're seeing in these newer collections. Here's their newest release, their newest collection. This is a zebra print. Love this one with the um, satin-like fabric for $478. It is the everything large tote. Also loving this bucket bag very simple but elegant i love the slouch can you guys see that name plate again very well done here's some more new releases so they're currently having a sale um buy more save more event but these newer pieces are not included in the sale and i'll tell you a bit more about the sale later here's another one that i absolutely love this chain reminds me of the coach beats chain the chain from the coach beats bag it's very very similar i'm not surprised because kate spade and coach are owned by the same parent company i actually really like this bag <laughs> i don't need another faux fur or faux shirling bag but i definitely love this one it's very cute it's very practical too here are some more new items i loved this tweet bag like i this tweet bag 
was stunning. I've never seen it before. I didn't have not seen it online. Again, it's one of their new releases. Um, the interior is leather. It's very small, very, very small. I do hope they make it in a larger size. But it is so it was so cute like the tweed was very well done and this is called the evelyn sequin tweed small shoulder bag currently retailing for 358 canadian dollars so just look at how cute i think the size is really nice on me honestly but i have so many of this style bags i have my tory birch i have my carl lagerfeld but i don't have anyone in tweed and this one the colors on this are just like fabulous really fabulous <laughs> Okay, now we're back to the other bags. Um, and this is part of the party collection as well. Love this one. This one exceeded my expectations from when I saw it online. I did not expect it to be this nice in person. Look at that nameplate again, the Kate Spade. Look at how substantial it is. This one is a very hard resin type material. This is the back of it. It's honestly so, so beautiful. These are the Sam Icon bags in different iterations they came out earlier in the summer and now they have these versions for the holiday very beautiful love the sam icon definitely looks like the prada 2005 re-edition this plain one is a classic comes in several different colors and several different um, variations i was actually contemplating between this sam icon and the hobo some icon and i'll show you that in a bit so here's the bigger tootsie roll style bag very very fun and that is the sam icon hobo in the color starlight here it is in the white and here is the sam icon in the white as well the regular sam, sam icon so both of the sam icon bags are definitely giving me prada vibes this is the Sam Icon with the longer shoulder strap. Here's that Tootsie Roll style bag again, but this time in the color Starlight with this beautiful silver fabric. Love that fabric. It felt really nice. The Sam Icon Hobo in white. So this is the second bag I came to see today. I just think that this style is really, really nice, really really white to key but elevated at the same time so i absolutely love it so it's between this sam icon and the um cleo small shoulder bag the small bucket bag rather so one of those two will be leaving i will be leaving with one of those two today i love that prada vibes for sure uh, but apparently kate spade has actually done this style uh years and years ago as well so everybody's doing reissues now y2k is on trend and everybody's bringing back their y2k styles so yeah um if you didn't know kate spade jewelry is really really great one of the best designer jewelry pieces i have a few kate spade jewelry pieces and i absolutely love them um i did a video about gifts designer gifts for the holidays and kate spade is in that video so i'll link that below for you guys to watch as well so one of the reasons why i love kate spade is their novelty pieces in fact all of their novelty pieces all of their bags at this point are like novelty pieces because kate spade's aesthetic is young and fun and happy and vibrant and playful and i love that like whenever i want a fun bag i always go to kate spade so here is one that looks like a book it's called the black beauty storyteller print Here's another fun bag, but this one is a micro bag, but it's actually very, very cute with the leopards on there. Are those leopards or cheetah? I can never tell the difference, but they're cute nonetheless with the black bow, like the oversized black bow. So it is leopard. It is a Lucy leopard embossed leather bag. So cute. So this is um, Kate Spade's floral prints. They do like different versions once in a while so this is one of their new versions this is the everyday large tote i've raved about this tote in my um, previous videos on kate spade leave the link to the tote below in case you want to purchase it but highly recommend one of the best contemporary designer totes in the market currently 
love love these green shoes especially for the party and holiday season goes great with the sam icon bag that has the floral patches on it very nice fun and playful so here are the two bags the cleo in green and the uh, sam icon hobo in starlight comment below let me know which one you guys think i should purchase or which one you think i did purchase We are done at Kate Spade. I'm very happy because I have wanted this for a while. So, and of course now it's time to go to Coach, the real playground, the main playground. And so yeah, let's go. We're at Coach, my favorite, favorite, favorite place. Oh, let's go in and see the beautiful. Carried away. <laughs> I'm getting carried away by how cute everything is. Oh. So right at the entrance of the uh, store are the studio bags, the newest studio bags in the patent leather version. Two beautiful colors. I like the studio. It has a baguette feel to it. This one is four hundred and thirty dollars. This is called the latte color. So you have the regular studio. You have the studio with uh rivets and then you have the big patent leather version they've styled it here in store with the silver link chain the chain does not come with the bag this one is 550 canadian dollars you can however purchase the chain separately and then you have the tiny baby studio uh, bags these shoes are also great for party season the suede shoes my essay says they are flying off the shelves now this is the main display when you walk into the store love it absolutely love it you have the heart bags which are all the rave currently i already have the heart bag bigger version in black my videos on that will be linked below so you can watch them later this T Rose crossbody is also cute. It's also a novelty piece that was just released. The T Rose is a classic for Coach, and they have reimagined it in the form of this circle bag. Very, very cute. And then you have the mini cushions there, also with the border rivets in crystal. I haven't seen that pink or hyacinth color before it's actually the first time i've seen it i think it's really pretty in the mini cushion style and then you have the rest of the hot bags signature canvas and them um, in the pink and red colors very cute now i'm happy that the regular tabbies are back they weren't released for a while but they're here now in the classic colors also the tabby uh, wallet on chain and this is the regular cassie in the dark stone i love this color online i'm not sure it will make me buy a tabby <laughs> i'm not a fan of the tabby but it is a great bag regardless especially in this dark stone color very very beautiful and this one currently retails for 550 canadian dollars Here's all the Rexy stuff. Rexy is one of their best sellers. People love anything with Rexy on it because she's honestly adorable. So lots of Rexy um, totes, the field totes, and then crossbodies, backpacks. And then you have the Cassie in the small size. You have Rexy ready to wear sweaters and shirts. Honestly, this store hardly gets um much ready to wear so i was actually surprised to even find this many or little depending on how you look at it so here's the cashing um sorry the cassie in the different colors that they have the black the spot red chalk and then the signature c canvas and this um smaller cashing currently retails for 360 canadian dollars why am i calling it cashing it is the cassie 19 yes Got that right eventually here's all the bag charms hang tags featuring rexy for christmas i really like that one with the tangled up christmas lights very cute
and here is the kit messenger featuring rexy as well this bag is honestly a great travel bag a great day bag a great errands bag a great themed parks bag and i love all the different colors that it comes in currently retailing for 270 canadian dollars these are the newer colors so they are not on sale there are some kit messengers that are on sale and i'll show you those later they still do have some of the um kochi collection card holders this is sweetie and then they had winky as well very fun collection if you're into that kind of style most of it is sold out so i'm actually surprised that they have um those two card holders left that's the studio 12 i believe or 13 in the flax color and here are um their releases for fall it was released earlier in the season so you ha also have gift sets for the um, holidays. I've never seen these before. I thought they were really, really good for $120. You get four different items in that beautifully packaged box. And my essay was showing me this sample or this set of sample size perfumes. I think they retail for 600 and uh, for 65 Canadian dollars. So you can test all the different scents that Coach has to offer. Here is the Sherlyn Madison bags. You have the bigger size and you have the smaller size. So the 18 size is 610 Canadian dollars. And I like that black and silver. And then this is the regular quilted Madison, but in the small 18 size as well. And this one is 480 Canadian dollars. Honestly wanted that Madison before, but since I got my heart bag, I really don't need that uh, bag in my collection i felt these shelly madisons and these ones retail for 850 canadian dollars love the puffy uh, hang tag this will honestly just be a sensory bag for me if i were to have it but i didn't really like the feel of the shelling on the madison uh, it just felt really stiff to me and i didn't expect that love this jacquard print so this is the black and cocoa jacquard in the rogue brief that's the regular pebble leather and this is the jacquard version i absolutely fell in love with this print this one retails about 900 dollars canadian and it just made me fall in love with jacquard i'm not i'm not a fan of the jacquard print like in the other colors it comes with but this is the first time i'm seeing that black and cocoa version with the silver i just think there's something about that silver toned hardware here are some of the perfumes and gift sets for men i thought you guys would like to see that they have those available this was the only thing they had from the scooby-doo collection and that is coach's most recently released collection they haven't got any other items in apart from these scarves and the uh, beanie um my store is not very high traffic so maybe they might have more at the vancouver store the burad street store or the um west edmonton mall store in edmonton or even the store most likely the store in toronto so for 550 canadian dollars you have this hitch backpack 13 so the small size which i think is absolutely adorable anything small is so cute i love the leather on this the leather is so so soft and luxurious here it is beside the regular sized um hitch i just think the comparison is so cute between the big and the small honestly honestly i i was so i was i'm lost for words as you can see like i don't know what to say i the only word i have for this is cute <laughs> The Bia Crossbody, one of their new styles, retails for 340 Canadian. The Deep Berry is on sale, but the chalk and the black are not included in the sale. And if you're wondering what sale I'm talking about, Coach is currently running their winter sales. They do have some bags and SLGs 30 to 50% off. And right here is the sale section. So this entire wall shows all of the bags that they currently have on sale so the tyler the uh tabby hobo the market totes the hating crossbody the kip crossbody um the kit messenger in some colors 
so all of these and more are on sale this heading is 162 canadian dollars they have the orange the blue the purple and then they have the kit messenger in this beautiful flax this flax and um i think that is pewter or black copper hardware it looks really cute yeah pewter hardware 126 canadian dollars and here is the kit messenger in the bonnie cash and floral print version also on sale here are the shilling pouches these are on sale but for 30 percent off so they come to about 258 dollars i think they're still a bit pricey but it is real shilling this is my favorite color this burgundy color i'll wait i'll wait till they're about uh 200 dollars or less or maybe when they hit the outlet reserves but i really like it i like the size yeah and i just like it as a handheld um pouch and then you have the camera bags that are also on sale in some colors not all this one retails for 252 at 40% off. You have this. So see the jacquard. This one is in ivory, le ivory leather and then the jacquard. I don't like it in that combination. But for some reason, the black and the cocoa jacquard version is just so nice, especially with that silver hardware. The willow toads in some colors, the Luna, uh, all on sale the soft tabby shoulder bag on sale the swinger even this disney world um version is also on sale 385 canadian dollars so i'm trying on the soft tabby shoulder bag this is a best seller this deep berry color is a very cute so i think most of the bags in deep berry are on sale because that's a seasonal color that was a summer color so most of the things in deep berry are included in the sale love the soft tabby i can see the appeal of this bag i can i understand why so many people like this bag it's really nice i like the slouch of it as well so this is the carry this is one of the new bags 480 dollars it is not part of the sale so i've moved away from the sale section and we're actually on the section that has the new bags or some of the new bags so here you have the rogues the rogue 17 the rogue 25 and the rogue 30. here's the rogue 30 in that same black and cocoa signature jacquard and leather combo with silver hardware i cannot get over that combination so here is four different sized rogues the 17 20 25 and 30. The 20 is the newest release. It's a nice in-between size. Currently retails for 610 Canadian dollars. They've done it in this black smooth glove tan leather with silver hardware. It's very, very cute. But honestly, I have two 25s and for some reason, this 20 just feels small. Maybe I'm just not used to it, but a lot of people love this size. They say it is perfect because the 17 is too small and the 25 was too big. You have the Revel in the black, and I purposely wore my Alma to the store today just so I could compare it to Coach Revel. So here you have the Revel in the 24 and in the 20. The 20 is the one in Jacquard. The 24 is the one in black smooth leather. So it has feet just like the Alma. The 20 is a little bit smaller than the Alma, and then the 24 is a little bit bigger than the alma so it really depends on what size you're looking for i know people that have the 20 and they're like it's not that small like it packs a good amount of small and i personally think the alma bb is small it is it's supposed to be a small bag so if it were me i would size up and do the revel in the size 24 but that's just my preference love the hang tag on the revel the smaller hang tag on the revel 20 is so cute the alma does not have a hang tag just the key hood
so the regular size revel is six hundred and ten dollars and then the 24 okay the small one is 24 is 520 canadian dollars Now this is the uh, rogue top handle i love this bag just look at the compartments look at how compartmentalized this bag is this is an organizer's dream and the compartments expand easily so it's not a small bag at all of course i love it in this black and signature jacquard combo with that thick leather chain strap but i have heard that it is coming out in more colors soon so if you like this style keep an eye out for that so this is when my sales associate brought me a gift. I was so shocked. I did not expect it at all. How do I want to undo? How do I want to undo this? <laughs> So a big thank you to the team at Coach Chinook Mall. I love their service. I love the relationship we have built. And thank you so much for the gifts that you've given me. If you guys are watching this, Natalie, Susan, thank you so much. So yeah, the back to the rogue top handle. This is my latest obsession. I really want this bag. I like it. I like it especially in this combination. But we'll see what other colors are coming and then I will decide. I thought you guys would like to see the comparison between these two versions of the Rogue 25 in the green color. So you have one smooth glove tan leather and another pebble leather. And here is another new color. This is the True Blue. I think that's what it's called in the Revel 24. Um, it's very popular, but I definitely prefer the blue fin from earlier in the year. Here's another new uh, pattern. This is the blue plaid. I'm not sure if that's the exact or official name, but yeah, that's the smaller bandits, the coach bandit in that color. Here is the bigger size bandit in the black and silver. Very pretty combination. 670 Canadian dollars. Love this black and silver that they're doing now. I really like that they're doing more silver hardware so pretty so again that's the blue plaid and then they have the red plaid version and i'll show you guys that in a bit i got distracted by this micro rogue <laughs> in red and i put it beside the rogue 25 so you guys could see the size difference okay back to regular scheduling here is the red plaid in the revel this is the full size revel i believe love this red plaid i prefer it to the blue it's much more vibrant than the blue one but i guess it depends on your style and so you can see it barely fits my wrist barely fits through actually i think this is smaller size this is the 24 so yeah just for just so you can see there that the handles are pretty they're pretty small my wrists barely fit through and my wrists are tiny so yeah this is the 24 and right above it is another red this is the red multi in the rogue top handle honestly when the style first came out i knew i liked it um and i wanted to see it but then people were saying it was small but i don't think it's small at all i think it will hold quite a good amount of stuff so i'm very excited now to have it back on my radar and to see um, what other colors it will come in so i'm just showing you guys the wall of shoes while i'm on my way to try on the rogue 25 from the new ski collection i love this dark rich moody brown and i love the patches on it this is very very nice a very nice um, combination and again this bag would be like a sensory bag for me if i were to get it because those patches are really really nice like they feel really good And here is my gift so very happy with that if you want to know what it is head over to my instagram at yellow sparks joy if you're not following me on instagram you should because that's where you get all of the 
information in real time okay this is the newest of the newest bag this is the demi shoulder bag in signature jacquard five beautiful vibrant colors 360 canadian dollars this is probably my favorite color very white okay um it's not my favorite style but i can see what they're trying to do i mean the white okay trend is hot so yeah that's that's exactly what they're doing i do like the craftsmanship on this bag and the quality the interior is a canvas and look what i'm trying on shoes because this matched the top handle rogue so you see i'm already planning ahead guys love the shoes very comfortable i tried them on and we'll see we'll see we'll see if i get them soon <laughs> or not guys very successful shopping trip i had just so much fun expect an unboxing soon if you're not yet subscribed please subscribe to my channel i would love to have you here don't forget to hit the tiny notification bell beside the subscribe button so you can get notified every single time i upload a new video i'll see you guys in my next one bye